chapter 5, verse 21. Little children, keep yourselves from idols. Hello everybody, Leroy Chavez here, Nomeo Shades with another shaving video. How is everybody today? I do apologize for my absence. I know it's been a little while, but it is what it is, man. That's just my life these days, so just roll with it. All right, uh, hopefully I got it squared away and I was able to post the, my unboxing of my video for my um, Sterling birthday gift to myself. Pretty cool. So I will be going with um, Intrepid Man. Let's go ahead and get rolling into the shave. Um, yeah, it's been a while, guys. Sorry. Um, what am I doing here? <laughs> it has been a while. Stand by. <laughs> uh, so as usual, I have... I always blew my soaps. And... Um, this is Sterling's Intrepid Man. This is based on Creed Santel. So far, no reaction. It's got some sandalwood in it. It's, 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 Creed Santel is a beautiful scent. Creed Ventus is probably my favorite, but Santel is really nice. Again, I mentioned it in my unboxing video. Scent strength is on the lower side. It's about the same scent strength as um, Rambling Man. Um, which is another really nice scent. Said bye. Yep, so let me go ahead and um, let this. Man, I'm really, really out of this morning, guys. I apologize. Let me wash my hands off. I'll start loading the brush and we'll, we'll get cracking again. brush today is the Zenith Boar. This is after the Sterling Boar brush. This is my absolute favorite boar brush that I have right now. I think it's a 25 or 26 millimeter knot. Great. I forgot the loft. Um, 45? I made that up. Sounded good. All right, but back to the soap. So um, I've been a little bit worried because this is based on a sandalwood and it's got sandalwood in it and I have tend I tend to have bad reactions to um, um, synthetic sandalwoods so we'll see how this goes so far with it blue water no big deal so we're just gonna load it like normal oh man that creamy goodness from sterling Woo. yeah so um, again guys I just want to apologize for my absence from the community again it's just like i said it's the past year and a half two years it's just been crazy for everybody you know and we're all dealing with it different ways at least now things are starting to open up again which is great So what have I been up to? Well, I just recently went to North Carolina for work. Was there for about two weeks. Got back a couple of days before um, Valentine's Day. Thank goodness. Last year I was gone on Valentine's Day. Oh my gosh, I was in so much trouble. That was a lot of trouble. Well, it was a good trip. And I recorded a video there. It didn't come out. Um, I was trying to, you know, go through it and stuff, and then I ended up deleting it. But in that video, I was trying to give my impressions of the um, King Gillette DE blades. They're not bad blades. Long story short, they reminded me of the um, the uh, 7 o'clock blacks. So if you like the 7 o'clock blacks, I think you'll like the, um, the King Gillettes. Man, is it has always sterling soap lathers up beautifully. Just want to scrub some more. This is, I don't think I've shaved since my birthday, which was the 28th. So I think this is about a week's worth of growth. I was talking to my wife about that last night, and she's like, You haven't shaved since your birthday? I'm like, No, I haven't. I shaved after that. And I'm thinking, I'm like, I don't think I have. <laughs> Alright, so 
in my unboxing, I mentioned that I'm going to go ahead with the Commissori. I'm actually kind of nervous. I haven't used one of these in months. Um, ever since I got the um, shit injector from Jason Bryan and then this, the supply, that's all I've used. So this is a brand new pack of Kai Captain Miles. I think these are the pinks. I hope these are the pinks. I didn't even check. But I love these blades. I was going to use a um, I was going to use a, a um, what was I going to use? Oh, I was going to use the uh, Feather Pro, but man, I couldn't get the blade out of the pack for some reason. Really odd. I gotta put this down there. All right. All right. First pass with the grain. Again, guys, I'm kind of nervous. Um, I haven't done this. I haven't used one of these for quite some time. So I'm probably going to be a little quiet. Oh, and um, nice, very nice. This is a new phone, so I, this is basically today's the first time I've ever really used a video. I got this phone, um, it's a Galaxy S22 Ultra, so it came just before my birthday, which is pretty cool. I was due for a new phone. So, comment on the video down below to see how it goes, please. I want to start experimenting with using my phone to make videos, so I'm starting, starting to do a little bit of research on um, different video apps, video editing apps, so we'll see how it goes. Today's videos, I'll just use the, my old trusty PC. I'm comfortable with that still. So that opening verse that I mentioned, that I read to you guys, um, those of us who are Christians, Maybe most of the world, actually. We're all familiar with idols. And of course, God does not like idols. But, ask yourself, what is an idol? An idol, really, is anything you put next to or above God. We're all guilty of doing that. Every single one of us. I mean, look how tied up we get with wet shaving. I mean, look how much look how much we get tied up with money, right? I mean, those are all idols. So just uh, you know, keep that in mind. Nothing should be equal to God and our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. That's just my interpretation of that of that verse. So what else have I been up to? Well, um, I've been wanting to um, get a unique hairstyle. I take it back. Not unique, but something I've been wanting to do for quite some time, actually. So. I started looking to, to um, actually proper ways to take care of your hair, right? To um, minimize hair loss and maximize growth. Man, there's a lot of info out there. A lot of weird stuff, too. So one thing I've been doing, right, is, you know, shampooing less.
shampooing less, you know, and then trying to keep my hair kind of oiled. So usually what I do now, I shampoo two, maybe, maybe just two times a week at the most. And when I do shampoo and conditioner, of course, I'll add a little bit of oil to my hair, kind of rehydrate the scalp. And I use better shampoos, right? Not the kind with the sulfates, no harsh chemicals. But some of that stuff can get really expensive, man. Holy crap. Like anything. Oops. But yeah, for the hairstyle that I want, I gotta I have to let it grow out a bit. So we'll see how that goes. I probably have maybe six months of <laughs> hair growth. <laughs> Taking my time and just just going slow, people. <laughs> I hope you guys are okay with that. <laughs> this might turn into a thirty-minute video. <laughs> uh. Let me just give you a quick little, reca a little recap on the um, Supply Razor. I've gotten six shaves off that thing. Off one blade, which is fan freaking fantastic. I saw um, Steven Davidson got that new, are they calling it the SE? It's got like a open comb kind of guard design to it, which looks really, really comfortable. Look at the zip right there. I didn't take off yet, so that's good. Okay. Oh, looks like I did. I'm gonna start bleeding here in a second. Nice. Been a while. Nice. <laughs> it's going pretty dang good. Nice. Really, really good. Do a quick little check. Good enough. That was annoying. I gotta touch up a little bit here. There. Okay. Oh, and a couple stragglers. Give me a, a minute here. I thought that was going to be a lot more bloody. I'm looking forward to using those EDPs, boy. Okay, let me let me rinse my brush off really quick. Not much.
little egg, but that's normal. Sorry, I think I had a booger. I think that booger was out of whole shape. <laughs> How many of you are going to go back and rewind and see if you can find it? <laughs> You gotta have a good sense of humor these days, don't ya? Alright. So this was awesome. Um, I like this soap. Like I said, it's a, it's a tad on the weaker side for my taste. I know some people like lightly scented soaps. But um, I think my batch of um, Rambling Man has the same scent strength. So it's on the three to four... And for, for my scent scale. Um, next shave, I'm probably going to go with Frankincense and Myrrh. Hopefully that doesn't have any irritation. But but yeah, this is a really, really nice shave. Again, everybody, I always do my post-shave off-camera. I do sebum. That's all I use. I don't use any balms. No aftershave splashes anymore. Um, right? I, it's just, I just like the way my face feels using sebum after shave. And actually, I use it daily. I mentioned that before 100 times, but it is what it is. I enjoy it. I'm a promoter. Recap. Razor was the Feather SS. Fantastic little razor. Um, this was graciously given to me by Trevor Bailey. Trevor, if you ever come across this video, again, thank you, my friend. I, I really appreciate this. God bless you. Soap was Sterling's Intrepid Man. Beautiful. This is based off of Creed's um, Absolute Santal or Santal Absolute. Can't remember which way it's pronounced. Beautiful, beautiful scent. It's really, really close. Really, really, really close. Um, but again, it's just a little bit on the lower end of the scent scale for me. Like I said, probably around a three or four. And then finally, I went with my Zenith Boar Brush. Love this brush. That's it, everybody. I hope you enjoy the shave as much as I did. I actually really did enjoy it. It was great. Um, no blood. I'm actually really, really shocked. <laughs> really shocked. So again, I'll get this video up sometime today, people. I appreciate it. Um, that's it. Um, again, I'm really bad about replying to comments recently. I apologize for that. But if you really need to have a question for me, hit me up on Facebook Messenger. I, I'll answer eventually. I'll probably answer faster there than on um, YouTube comments. Sorry. I'll try to get to those. Anyways, thanks again. I love each and every one of you. God bless each and every one of you. And as always, everybody, please don't text and drive. Take care.